Hello everyone, and welcome back to Falcon Age, where we are exploring the abandoned town that is probably all that is left of our people's original homes before we get ready to go and hunt sand wolves in the desert. So I'm a little nervous about that, but we've been handling so far all of the different outposts and robot problems that we've had just fine. And, you know, it'll be good to explore some of what's to our entire home. So, let's go ahead and see. Hi, isn't she a beauty? My daughter and I are trying to restore this old girl to her former glory. Your daughter up there seems to be doing all the work. I'm helping. I'm holding the ladder. I really don't think the ladder needs to be held. But okay, if believing makes you happy. Honestly, no. What would make me happy is being young again. Did you know that when I was her age, I was the first person from this valley to climb up to the peak of Kissing Rock? No ropes, no tools, just my hands and feet and indomitable will. I miss those days. Be careful if you go up in that direction. These days, Kissing Rock is almost impossible to climb. Why is that? Soil erosion. The Outer Ring Company's mining operations ruined the topsoil, and well, that just made everything less stable. I'll be careful. Thanks for the warning. It's not a problem. It's what us old people are for, to pass on our wisdom. Sorry. Well, that's all right, age happens. We all get old, unless you're part of the Outer Ring Company. In which case, you become a digitalized brain at some point. At least, that's what I heard. That's really terrifying. At least this current human body I have is getting very forgetful. I have a bad habit of leaving bag things in bags on cliff walls. On my very last expedition to Kissing Rock years ago, I left my bag of harvesting tools on the rock face somewhere. If you find that particular bag of tools, please bring it back to me. That particular bag of tools was a gift for my late husband. Oh, what? Of course I will! Oh, I'll, I'll do my best and like, power to you, daughter, for like, building that together. It seems like mostly it's just a few women and a couple men left here. Sir? You know what really bugs me? Uh, the state of the planet? The state of the planet and how we're all being treated by the Outer Ring Company? Why do we hunt rabbits? Oh! A bit of a swerve in the conversation, but I'm with you, dude. I mean, why can't we train rabbits to hunt instead? They're so much easier to breed. We could have entire armies of hunter bunnies. Sorry, what? They'd look so adorable with armor, too. Just imagine it. I guess I can see it. See? There's method to my madness here. Here's something for you. Anyway, I'm starving. Could you bring me some meat so I can cook? Preferably rabbit meat. It's so tender. Wait, I thought you liked bunnies. I do. Why do you ask? But you just asked me to get you rabbit meat. Well, yeah. Bunnies are incredible in all ways. Including flavor-wise. I'm going to get the spice mix ready. You take care, righteous friend. Huh. Well, we got a special item from him at least. <laughs> I have no idea what he is all on about, but at least uh, at least we got something from him. So we have a new special item. <gasps> oh my gosh. Come here, come here. Come on, Vansuki. Hala, here girl. Oh, 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 I hear her. Hala! Ah, there she is. I think she's coming on down. Hala, come on! You don't want to come? Do you not want to have the adorable little skateboard? Alright, she seems very, very focused on what's going on here. Wait, is she getting something thrown at her? I don't think so. Hey kid, you've never seen a juggler before. What's a juggler? Your job looks amazing. Hmm, yeah, won't lie. The job is pretty sweet. I've been doing this since I was a kid. Tumbling, fire eating, but mostly juggling. Why juggling, specifically? It's fun. Also, it creates an interesting mental environment that allows for some deep thoughts. What kind of deep thoughts have you had? Lately, I've been thinking a lot about why some people don't like me. I guess they're disappointed I'm not a hunter or a craftsman. And I get why. They worry about keeping the community fed and sheltered. Well, 
<sighs> you know, I don't want to be very judgmental, but considering what's left of our community seems centered around a man who wants to, like, breed bunnies, a man who wants to rip everybody off, an artist, an old woman, and a juggler, I'm beginning to see why my aunt is a little bit, um, the way she is. But after a point, you need to do more than just feed the body. You need stories and myth and laughter to remind the soul why it wants to survive. Wow. Yeah, you do. Have you tried saying that to your naysayers? No point. If people want to hate something, they'll just continue hating it. Oh, that strikes really close to home. Alright, Mr. Juggler. In another realm, in another life, maybe I happen to be a Let's Player and I hear that a lot too. So I'm going to remember your, your wonderful words of advice. If people want to hate something, or act like they hate you, they're just going to do it. You shouldn't have to worry about defending yourself. What you really have to do is work from the inside. Show them why they don't have to hate the thing they think they need to hate. That's really profound. Like I said, you get a lot of thinking time with this profession. Can you teach me how to juggle? Hey, you know what the secret of juggling is? Always be focused on what's in front of you. Grab, toss, catch, grab, toss, catch. Whether you're juggling three balls or ten melons, it doesn't matter. It's all the same thing. It's not that hard. Start with one object, grab it, toss it in the air, and try to catch it. And then try to toss two objects with two hands. Maybe toss the other hand. Keep trying and you'll be able to juggle three things eventually. Good luck. Here's something for your bird to play with. Anyway, come visit whenever you're in the area. You might see me working on a new trick. <laughs> that was really cool. And you know what? I mean, maybe it's kind of like a little meditation session for all of them. Can I talk to him again? No new tricks yet for now. That's so awesome. Hava, is that what you were looking at? Come here, dear. She's really, really kind of resisting coming over. I wonder if she's, oh, what? This is another spot to bomb. Hava, come on, girl. If we could blow this up, that'd be amazing. Hey, have you met my cousin? He set up a lightning golf course over at the farm. You should try it out. A lightning golf course? What? How the there you are, dear. All right, you ready? Let's see, do I have any bombs by chance? If I do, I do. Okay, how the? Come here, girl. All right, she got it. Right here. Yes! Good girl, Hava! I'm so proud of you! Here, let me go ahead and try giving you a little snack. You definitely have earned it. Um, okay, so I think... I, let's go ahead and feed her this tasty samosa. Her first one, so that she can get a defense boost. Oh, that's so cute! But it only lasts for a little while. Okay. So, if that's the case, we definitely want to grow more green fruit and red peppers. There, look at that! Wonderful. Oh, and I can hear the water going through here. Well, you know, if everybody else... Up you go, Hava. If everybody else is busy juggling and painting and trying to keep the human spirit alive, I don't mind being one of the ones to get a little bit of the farming up and going. So, all right, I think we've explored all over here. Oh, but Hava, come here, girl. Do you want to come back down? There we go. While we wait for those, why don't we go ahead and see your little new outfits that the people gave us. So, skater bird. <gasps> oh, that's so cute. All right, so she can do a cute little skater bird thing. And, <gasps> how about the juggler? Oh, that's adorable. Okay, that definitely, definitely perks me up. I love it. And I wonder if we can do the basic headpiece. There you go, Vasuki. Let's go ahead and give you that. Let's go ahead and give you those. And you know what? Let's take her baby hat off for just a minute. Whoa. Wow. Yeah, we'll leave her baby outfit off for just a minute. So that we can try to inspire the people of the village. And they can know, hey, there's somebody with one of the falcons here. I think that'd be good for them. All right, 
Let's grow more of these green fruits because we can make those into some of the melon treats. And we can go ahead and leave these behind, I think. And we'll probably want to get more of the samosas up and going. But it's good to know we won't have to go as far as we did last time in order to get more farming done. Because I have to walk everywhere. There's no instant teleportation between different locations. You have to slowly but surely make your walk. Bring sand wolf. Yes, I know. We're going to work on that soon. But the reason you have to manually do this kind of walking is because originally this entire adventure was a VR adventure. So it took a year after it was VR before it became something we could do on PC. But I'm totally living for this. All right, let's make sure we get a little bit of rest. Somebody's on guard. And so next, we'll want to start heading out of here. And that's actually a good question. Where do I go? The other side of town should let me out. And towards, yeah, towards the area where we need to go. Anybody in here? Oh, there is somebody in here. Hello? No, no, I'm fine. I just need a little break. It's there, you know? It's just so bad. What's causing the pollution? The refineries, probably. They belch out so much smoke. The Outer Ring Company said they'd get us filters, but there's a lot of paperwork to go through. Shouldn't they make this a top priority? I guess, but we're just one colony of many to them. Who has the time? Not them, obviously. I wish the refineries would just go away, though. Anyway, I'm gonna take a nap. Wake me if the air gets even better. Well, hopefully one day, dude. All right, do I have enough to cook anything? Nope, not at the moment. All right, well, with all that in mind, I think we can get out of town. There's Ahsoka. Oh, wait, Ahsoka, wait. How do I, how do I get out of town? That's actually a good question. Uh, okay, hang on. Do we come up here? Let's see. Yeah, I think you come up here and then you go around into the back. Like this direction. All right, let's try that out. Maybe back here? We've got the little houses. There we go, this leads us down. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, this is how we, we come out. But all right, so hopefully we'll, now that we have several quests from, I mean, just literally a handful of people who remain, we can work our way out of this protected little valley. I guess people left this on purpose. Whoa. Whoa, our aunt had a painting of that in her house, I remember. I remember being really impressed with it. I Let's see if we can get... Oh, there she goes! Oh, what a good huntress! Let's go ahead and see what she has caught. Good job, Vanzuki! What did you end up getting, huh? Some fox meat! Oh, a fox! I'm so sorry. I know my friend Jack will be so distressed to know we hunted a fox, but to be fair, I just saw potential food and sent Hava after it. All right. Let's see, so far so good. There's some sentries we can take out. Let's come on over. I don't think we need to go over into that area. Let me double check the map. Let's see the outpost. It looks like we can go all the way around and that kissing rock might, yeah, the outpost isn't something we need to do just yet. So let's not pick fights. We might make it more difficult for the villagers if we start trying to tear apart all of the robots. I mean, what if they send reinforcements from from the mothership? Like, I'd feel really terrible if we made it worse for the villagers who aren't trying to pick any fights. Just in case though, I'm ready. I don't mind picking fights. Apparently I have a bomb, like, blasting sort of personality. <laughs> Who is um, a little bit more ready for this than I expected. Huh. 
Plus, these are good to practice on. Dang it. Okay, there's the other one. And then once about five of them come out... Did I throw that one behind me? Oh, oh! Good job, Hava! Good job, girl! Yeah, she's really good at that. Yeah, that didn't upset the other sentries. I think that's probably a sacred rock of some kind. Is that kissing rock? I guess that might be kissing rock. Oh, nice. Super crush patty recipe and the super silent spring roll recipe. So we just found a couple more recipes. So the super crush patty recipe, charisma two, 20% store discount. <gasps> So when you have charisma, then your bird is able to help you get a store discount. Oh, and you can get stealth boost. Interesting, with the super silent roll. But both of these require like food that I haven't discovered yet, but nifty. And you know what? I bet that is kissing rock. Look, I can even see a bag. Can I focus on it from here? I can! Hava, we might be able to get that woman's bag. Gosh, she's beautiful. Let's get her over here before the, the drones get her. Come on, Hava! Okay, good. The drones aren't getting her. Good girl! Are these... Oh, good. And she got away before that thing found her. Is that... Yes! It's the old climber's tools! Sweet! So we'll be able to take them back to her. They're a gift from her, like, late husband. So that's, like, kind of important, if you ask me. But alright. So, guys. We're gonna continue on. Up you go, Hava. Listen to her little bells. What's this? Oh, this is one of those things you can like dig up, I think. Oh, but I can't dig it up. We have to give her the digging ability and then she'll be able to dig it up. All right, let's keep moving. We'll get to the other side. Hopefully there will be a place to rest. I hear electricity, I think. Oh, it's my little baton. Oh, and... All right, Hava. Come on. Come on, Vonsuki. I know she's, there she is. Oh, she got it. All right, well, she's definitely a wonderful huntress. Look at her go. Bring it, girl. Good job. We'll put that away and up you go, my dear. All right, so we're gonna continue on into the wilds, searching for the place where we will potentially, as the sun shifts around us, find the first, <gasps> that person scared me so bad. Find the first of the wolves that we are searching for. So if you guys would like to join us on that and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, Stay curious, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.